the top 10 trending sunscreens from around the world. In case you're new here, these results come from my Instagram stories where there are at least hundreds of people that participate. SPF voting week is always a long process because I run a poll dedicated for like worldwide product. So where everybody's voting on all the brands mixed together. But then I also break down voting by region. I'll personally talk through the top 10 ranking of the global vote. And then after that, I'll just flash up on screen the results separated by region. So, so then if you want to screenshot it or pause or whatever, you can. I'll also have the list noted down below. Something to keep in mind is that most of my followers are from like Western countries. So that probably does skew the results. And because I'm Australian, Australian brands have a little bit of a higher placement in the list. Now I did run dedicated voting for Africa and South America, but I just have very low follow accounts from these countries. So the voting results for those regions ended up just being like a top product rather than a top 10 list. Hopefully if I end up gaining some more followers on Instagram, it'll be a little bit more of a well-rounded vote, but I can only sort of pass on the information that I have. So let's get into the worldwide top 10. And sorry, before I do that, I'll just mention, I'm not really going to add my personal opinions on these because a lot of them I already know are too sort of shiny. I'm definitely a matte SPF fan, which is very hard to find. I've already filmed a video of my top three matte sunscreens, so I'll be posting that soon. Anyway, back to the top 10. Number 10 on the list is the Naturium Dew Glow SPF 50. This is actually the only American sunscreen that made the list, so congratulations to Nati. Number nine is Ultraviolet Fave Fluid SPF 50 Plus, and this is a little bit of a newer release for, for Ultraviolet. Number eight is the Biore UV Aqua Rich Watery Essence SPF 50 Plus. This is specifically the Japanese version, not the kind of relaunched US formula. Number seven is the Numbuzin, Buzin, Numbuzin, Number seven on the list is the Clear Filter Sun Essence SPF 50 Plus. Number six is the La Roche-Posay UV Immune 400 and Thelios SPF 50 Plus. Number five is the Haru Haru Black Rice Moisture Airy Fit Daily Sunscreen SPF 50 Plus. Some of these names are so long. <laughs> Number four is Airy Day Golden Glow SPF 50 Plus. And you'll notice the theme, these are all SPF 50 or SPF 50 plus, which is great to see. Number three is the Skin 1004 Hyaluseca Water Fit Sun Serum, also SPF 50 plus. Number two is Ultraviolet Supreme Screen, again SPF 50 plus. And number one, with probably no surprise, is the Beauty of Dosen Relief Sun SPF 50 plus. So that's the global ranking. The next few slides are going to be the ranking separated by each region. I've basically just gone by continent, essentially.